Casey, an education rights ballot proposal that has been submitted to Attorney General Tim Griffin's office four times is finally approved. Four our kids filed the Arkansas Educational Rights Amendment of 2024. It calls for universal pre-K for kids ages three and four, establishes minimum school quality standards, and requires that private schools meet the same standards as public schools if they accept public dollars. Organizers now have to gather more than 90,000 signatures from registered voters in at least 50 counties by July 5th for it to appear on the November ballot. Meantime, a group looking to change medical marijuana accessibility is in the state is now working to get that issue on your November ballot. Last month, Attorney General Tim Griffin approved the Arkansas Medical Cannabis Amendment of 2024, submitted by the Arkansas Cannabis Alliance. If approved by voters, it would change current medical marijuana laws by expanding who qualifies to sign off on medical marijuana cards. Currently, the role is limited to doctors, but this proposal would add nurse practitioners, physician assistants, and pharmacists. Medical marijuana cards would also expire after three years under the proposal rather than the current one-year limit. It gives more access, easier process, longer cards. Uh, it's just going to be a better program. Right now, we just want to educate people about what's wrong with this amendment and people need to know there's a lot wrong with this amendment. Organizers now have to gather more than 90,000 signatures from registered voters in at least 50 counties by July 5th for this to appear on your ballot come November.